Chris Raby for SSM Physical Therapy. Whether you're a high school athlete or a parent, injuries don't need to keep you out of the game. Let the licensed physical therapists at SSM Physical Therapy help. Like them on Facebook. Find one of their St. Louis area locations at SSMPhysicalTherapy.com. This week, our CAMOX High School Spotlight brings us to Waterloo High School, home of the Bulldogs. Also, home of a pretty good baseball team and a star player who was a National Player of the Year and All-American. Jordan McFarlane, new to Waterloo this year, has taken to his new teammates quickly. But it's some old teammates, his family, that's made perhaps the biggest impact in his playing career. Blue, black, white. Ooh. Oh, that was it. Jordan McFarlane says he's already in a win-win situation. Inside the top 100 baseball prospects in the country, it wouldn't be a surprise to hear his name in the June Major League Baseball first year player draft. And if, if anything happens other than that, that's a bonus to me. You know, regardless, I get to play baseball, which is, which is all I wanted to do since I've been a little kid. So, you know, when that time comes, I'll just kind of play it by year. But until then, I'm, I'm planning on just going to Arkansas. McFarland's senior season is also his first at Waterloo High School. Head coach Mark Vogel says in just one season, the transfer outfielder has already made quite the impression. He's got an even keel. He doesn't get too high, doesn't get too low, uh, and has great work habits. And his attitude actually rubs off on our, on our other kids. You know, when your best player has that kind of attitude and work ethic, it's, it's, it's really been good for the whole group. In 25 years of coaching, Vogel says there has been no one else like McFarland. When you factor in everything from the athletic ability, the work habits, the, you know, the effort level, uh, he's probably the most talented kid I've coached in 25 years. Both Fogel and McFarland indicate Jordan's parents as reasons for his success. I think the most important person in my life is my mom. I mean, the sacrifices that she's made, you know, my dad, he's been throwing to me since I've been, you know, in, in grade school, and I just couldn't be more appreciative for for the job they've done with me. Baseball has become a game that, that involves a lot of travel. It involves a lot of expenses, and mom and dad make a lot of sacrifices to give these kids opportunities. McFarland says his mom even had to take a second job to afford summer league travel. I'm just lucky to have my, my mom is so supportive of anything I could do. I could, I could say, hey, I want to go be some, some at a completely different school, and she'd probably support me, and she's just been always like that for me, and I, it's awesome. Waterloo still has its sights set on a postseason run this spring. There, that's all. Yes, and McFarland says he'll worry about the rest whenever he gets there. I want to play this game a long time, and, and you know, the ultimate goal is to get up there, but, but the steps that I take to get up there, you know, can vary, and regardless of, of how I get there, I just want to be the most successful I can at each stage for sure. Thank you to Jordan, Coach Vogel, and everyone here at Waterloo. Also our great producers, Sam Masterson and Ben Boyd. Thank you, as always, to our great sponsors at SSM Physical Therapy. If you have an injury that's keeping you on the sidelines, let SSM Physical Therapy get you back in the game. Visit SSMPhysicalTherapy.com for more information. If you've got an idea for the spotlight, let us know. Email us, kmoxsports at gmail.com, or tweet us at KMOX Sports. In Waterloo, Chris Raby, KMOX.